Tessin, Tessin. Oh, welcome to uh, the Jetty Jet Show. This is uh, Jetty Jet. We are live. How's it about doing tonight? We got a great show for you tonight. We got joining me tonight is uh, it's a special guest, a good a good friend of mine. I consider him my little brother. His name is they call him Ajimi. Ajimi, how's it going, hey, Ajimi? Hey, this is Jetty Jet from the Jetty Jet Show. No, 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 you're not the Jetty Jet. I'm gonna I'm gonna confuse them because your voice sounds the same. This is my little brother. <sighs> I think I think yeah. Um, we did have a little confusion. Actually, you're actually talking in the same tone too, and that's like even worse. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, my name is Jimmy. His name my is Jimmy, and he draws. Uh, I usually have some like a lot of your followers, so we might have somebody in here that knows who I am. Yeah, some people might know. This is Jimmy. Jimmy draws. Jimmy draws. He's gonna be drawing for us today because um. I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to get things set up and stuff because I'm always like really laggy and and uh, clunky with the start. So please, that's your that's your screen there. He's gonna do a little sketching. We're gonna be doing a couple uh, live stream sketches of the animus, the waifus, the painting, the brushes, the clip studios, all of that good stuff. So I hope you guys can sit around and chill. Uh, and this the, is Jim, the Jimmy Jim Show. This is a continuation on our our Artist Alley Stream Edition series because we have a uh, we have a national health emergency and a lot of artists are now home stricken and shows are being canceled left and right. I believe like five or six shows have been canceled. Um, and so yeah, that's why we're here. We're gonna be drawing from home do our best to entertain and not be lame you know what I'm saying <laughs> hey good eye good eye frankly oh says the jetty jet I mean the <laughs> frankly oh says <laughs> <laughs> April Ludgate yo another one and another one Freddy girl Freddy Freddy girl Number one, I think should have should have uh, gotten this out of the way, is yes the Jimmy Jim show, <laughs> trash man. <laughs> Finally, yes. So he is. I do consider him my little brother because he is actually he's actually like the only other Cambodian artist, full Cambodian artist. There's another Cambodian artist we know. Yeah, yeah. But it's really really rare to find any Cambodian artist out there. Yeah. Very rare. Um, yeah, please let us know if you guys can hear us loud and clear. I don't know if I turned the sound up right. It's very, very important. Everything goes to crap when I when I learn that I am not live. I think we are, because the guy said the Jimmy Jim. Yeah, and he's... A... That's great, that's great. So, how you been, man? It's been like... How long has it been since we talked? Uh, quite a bit. Quite a bit. Quite, quite a bit quite a bit of couple it was like i think maybe we touched base really quickly maybe three months ago or something two months ago something like it's kind of like we play tag nowadays everybody's all doing their own things we're not so like we had a really nice hub of artists at one point where it was just this this nice centralized studio station it's all like um through the internet it's not like we're actually hanging out but man your thing's hopping oh thank you Anton Tian Tian Cole oh, someone I would like to see more Dojin from now on <laughs> been jerking around that's weird <laughs> want to see more. yeah your screen's jump, jump jumping it's like boop 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 boop, boop because of uh, Google Hangout uh, okay. let me try to figure it out hold on shouldn't be jumping Yeah, it's just jumping. I don't know why. Maybe are you? You said you're on your your phone. Huh? You said you're on your phone. 
No, I'm drawing on my Cintiq right now. Oh. Yeah. Should be fine. I wonder uh, if you guys can hear the music. There's... It's the Jetty Jet Show, a really good show. <laughs> it's... Correction by Diane Pan. Not today, it's the Jimmy Jim Show. Oh. Diane Pan... Hey. Diane Pan, if you feel like dropping in, you got the link. Diane Pan is a true G, true killer in art. She will straight assassinate you with her her uh, skill level. I'm just gonna do like, a lot of construction because I don't feel like I can draw properly right now. Yeah. I just woke up, so. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder, because I have music playing as well on the same track as you are, so um, let me know if you. Let, if if uh, the music is overpowering Jimmy's voice because he's on the same um, track, and uh, yeah, hope you guys understand what I'm talking about. Grand Blue Fantasy launched today on PSN and Steam. That's pretty exciting. That's yeah. really exciting actually because I love Grand Blue, the art. I love a lot of things, but I don't play them. That's the problem. I just enjoy the art. <laughs> I don't play any of these scenes what it is though so tell us a little bit about your drawing what is what is that is that mega man sure no I, I usually do some like my construction is pretty normal see this this uh, this man's construction is is a very very clear and distinct and no yeah. we call I'm it just the, gonna yeah I was just gonna go to my comfort zone this is the no game. this is the no BS yes yeah, stay as comfortable as possible just draw the like like if you like feel like, you know what? I don't know what to draw. Draw the easiest pose. That goes for anybody. Just draw the easiest like hero pose you can ever think of, and don't try to invent anything new. Just like have fun with it, and then modify it slightly. Um, yeah, that's was, that was my plan. I didn't know what to draw, so I was like, uh. have, he has such confident lines though. You see how see how like each line can, is literally a whole entire segment of anatomy. And that's please excuse the glitches. Ah, oh, Bruno says music is very low. Thank you. Diane Pond says, "What up, Jimmy?" My Diane, my big sister. Yeah. Tr Trashman. How do you do usually go? Do you get like ask you questions and you just kind of? Yeah, because I I I was managing a lot of things, and I know that you can just uh, help me sketch. And I can um, get my my station situated while you just be a little background, a bit of a little mm -hmm. background noise, and a little background noise, just to distract them for a second, because uh, it takes me at least an hour to get ready. <laughs> After I I am like late or delayed right. on my stream for an hour, it takes me an extra hour in stream to get set up. Wow. But this is nice. So and you can't hear it right now, but I have uh, I've got some vaporwave retro music going on in the back. Oh, okay. But you're oh. gonna love it. You're gonna love oh, yeah. it. Oh, you know what? I think slowing it down. Here it is. I'm sharing my screen with you. So I won't share my screen with you. Let's do that. Maybe that's gonna help with the glitch. Maybe. Cause it's like. I think we did it. <laughs> <laughs> Rising up back on the street. You guys stay healthy out there, stay hungry, staying tough, staying hungry. Cause we got the coronavirus running around. Make sure you get you get your toilet paper. Otherwise you're gonna have to use the shower for uh, cleaning up. Wait, isn't that what we're already supposed to do? I mean, yeah. <laughs> You don't? Oh. But not after oh. every number two. Number two is like, you don't need to hop in the shower. I'm, that's usually, I just, I just use TP. Only paper ain't enough. What do you mean, though? Yeah. So, we were at, we were at Costco today. <laughs> Me and Boogie's gonna die because we were at Costco and, um, we went there for fresh fruits, avocado, strawberries. 
<laughs> we weren't there for anything other than like food, like actual food, like chicken and stuff. But everybody was going crazy. It's a Friday morning, and it's more packed than I ever seen ever. More than Christmas. Ladies are crashing their cart into me like they don't give a shit. Like I need to get in here. I need to. I need to cut you off, young man, young sir. Um, two times in, in on the street, I was like, did they just? They just. I mean, me and Boogie's looking at each other like, did they just cut me off like that? Like, wow, I really look like a bitch right now. <laughs> like, just twice. <laughs> Oh, it was rough. It was rough, man. I'm like, it's only, it was only like 10 a.m. when we were checking out. And the lines were like, were flooding the, you know, like, um, all the way up to like, uh, the, the medicine area. I don't know. Costco's are all like usually laid out the same, but it wouldn't. The lines were so long. Right. And there were no toilet papers. There were no, there's no rice. I heard somebody stabbed somebody. What was it, Boogie? Somebody stabbed somebody. <laughs> Somebody I should have somebody, right? Oh, at a Sam's? Yeah, somebody like broke off a wine bottle. Over, over what? Over a bottle of water. Over a pack of bottled water. So somebody over a, over a pack of water at Sam's Club is like the, the competitor to Costco. They over a, bo over a box of water, they broke a wine bottle and then stabbed somebody because they were fighting over it. Yeah, they had it at a Costco in Brooklyn. Costco in Brooklyn. Two ladies got in a fight. Two ladies got in a fight. Look, look, man, stay, stay, stay chill, stay chill, babies, stay cool, stay cool. It's o it's okay, man. It's okay. You ever heard of the faucet? I mean, American water's pretty clean. You can go and boil it, for the most part. <laughs> like, or use the Brita filter. They're not gonna shut off your water. I mean, most likely they're not. I mean, don't quote me on that, but. <laughs> most, most likely they will keep your water running. It's not like a, it's not like a earthquake or natural disaster. It's, well, this technically is a natural disaster, but you know what I'm saying. Anyways, look at these nice lines. Keep going, keep going, man. Nice. I'm so oh, bad, right? Trash man. That's what the sink is for. Oh no, he's talking about the the TP. <laughs> You dirty trash man. <laughs> By the way, his name is Trash Man. I'm not calling him Trash Man because he's that's his name. Oh shoot, what it? Doko desu ka? Omae wa doko desu ka? Omae wa doko nigeren da. Nige Nigerenda. Nige. Nigeru is to to escape. So nigeru. Nige. Ah. Doko ni nigemashita. Nigeta. I think that's how you should say it. Oh, there you are. Ha. Too late quoted. Trash man. Trash man, you have to be over OBS in order to actually control the. Oh wait, no, never mind. It does. It does work. It does work. It doesn't have to be over OBS. Oh. Oh. Okay, I'll pause this one. Keep this running. This is One Punch Man, isn't it? No. No. No OC. He has like a cape and a spear. I like it. I'm gonna draw like a, an adult version of him. You need to teach me how to draw like you, dude. This is t you draw way better. What do you mean? <laughs> no, I don't. You show you were trying to show me like a long time ago. I was like, man, so confident the lines. Oh, I'm just lazy. I found like the laziest. I don't even know anatomy. I'm just like, I think there's a muscle here, so I'm gonna draw a curve. Makes and I sense. think there's another muscle, so I'm gonna Makes draw another sense. curve. Yeah. No need to overcomplicate it. Keep it simple, stupid. Except when I actually try to render and like do lighting with like muscles and stuff, I'm just like, okay. Uh, what goes here? Nigeta. Doku ni nigeta. Doku ni nigeta. People still like ask for like drawing tips. Nigeru. How do you say that? 
<laughs> Don't get confused, kids. I'm serious. That's how you say escape. You get it. <laughs> He's just laughing. Mong is just gonna come in and like not say anything or not do anything. Just leave. Nigeru. 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 Oh, 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 oh. Escape, get out. Escape. Es, es. You can also say escape. Es, escape. 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 Kuruma. There's really no activity in the show. There's. We got like three it's people watching. We're like, who the hell is this guy? Dude, we got a new hero in town. You gotta take over. You gotta take over, man. I failed. One day. I have held. You have to pass on the torch, okay? I entrust no. this torch over to you. I can't handle the awful one. I entrust it to you. Are you oh. studying Japanese too, Jaddy? Mmm, I used to study. Been a while. Wasserechata. Wasserechata. I forgot. Wasserechata. Wasserechata. I need activity. Just nice to have you streaming. Aww. Harry. Wow. Harry Cat, Corey. Harry Cat. Nice. I don't see a piece I was working on. Harry Cat goes eye mass. <sighs> Mojit. Yeah, yeah, show me. Okay, so. Let me switch over to mine so I don't see anything personal. Mm. Got you. Just let me know when you're ready to go. I'm my nudes by accident. Schlang, 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 schlang. All right, I'm gonna draw this one extra fast, okay? This so today we're gonna be drawing for you. We're gonna be doing cloud, cloud, okay, cloud. So we're gonna, do, we're gonna use, uh, we're gonna use Jimmy technique. See, nice, nice, simplified shapes. Nice simplified shapes for the head, okay? I'm gonna draw these nice um, guidelines. Okay, nice guidelines, just. Setting up our rough draft. Okay, keeping it nice and loose. I want to draw the shoulder line here like this. And then the shoulder muscles like that. Is that how we do it? Jimmy, is that how we do it? Yep. Jimmy. Okay, thank you, Jimmy. Jimmy's teaching me today, okay? Let's just go and just use straights and moderate curves. Okay, what if I did this? Is this okay? Muscle for the shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> is that all right? <laughs> sure. Okay. And then just do like that. How about chest muscles like this? They're okay. <laughs> okay. And then you wouldn't do that, right? You would do something else. Damn. I don't know. I failed you. Oh my god. You got hips. Oh no. I'm drawing too many girls. <laughs> I failed. I failed. Oh, hand right here. Okay, hand right there. Okay, we're gonna draw the hand first because there's a trick. It's a nice trick to draw hands. I mean arms and hands. You draw the hands first. I guess you get your placement down right first, and then you can connect things later. Oh, I'm gonna just draw these knuckles, dude. I'm I'm cheating, man. I'm breaking your rules. <laughs> I'm lost. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm lost. And then there's another thing too about drawing guys. Honestly, I feel like it's easier than drawing girls. You feel me? Because you can make them muscular and blocky and, and grotesque <laughs> and rough and angular. But when you draw girls, it's like one small little mm. like off angle. And it's just like, what's that? You gotta focus on the face. Why? Yeah. You're, you're like jacked. Yeah, talking about the face. Yeah. Like what's wrong with her? What's wrong with the... I don't even know this cloud. This is just... This I'm going to pick you. Man, I need to, okay, I'm gonna switch back over to you. What the hell, how'd you do that? Oh, shoot. <laughs> I saw your, I, Some of it. I saw your hidden folder. 
Oh no. <laughs> Exposed. Just kidding. I can't find it. What the heck? It's not a hidden folder. Just kidding, you guys. There. So I'm trying to capture the, the essence of this pose. Totally not what um, Cloud would do. I don't even know the how he would pose because I haven't played it. Played the demos. Amazing. This jawline is so bad. <laughs> this jaw looks so bad. Okay. But I just... I wanted to do something really quickly because I know I like I fuss around a lot whenever I try, try to draw girls. It's like there's too much pressure. Honestly. Mm -hmm. Too much. Like, oh, she has to be really sexy she has to be sexy or she has to be like really pretty or the angles i don't i don't know what i'm talking about i'm saying i don't know what i'm saying jimmy help me i can't find it i'm dying what are you trying to do are you trying to find like something a... yeah okay it's, pretty, it's a pretty big one too i spent like a lot of time on it <laughs> I was like, I was like the way you draw faces, though. Can you see my screen? Uh, not on a hangout, but I could see it on the no. the YouTube's. Oh, <laughs> it means so much from my little brother. <sighs> you know, I think I get too uh, hyper when I stream. And that's probably part of the reason why I don't do well. I feel mm. like, like, <laughs> if I was just like one of those streamers or artists who can just like be hella chill, like some artists are so chill. Like you hear Art, art Germ draw? Mm -hmm. So calm, collected. Like he's not a nutcase like me. It would just be like, okay, and now you're going to draw the face? Okay, good. And this is how I like to draw the lines. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is hair. Hair, you draw hair strands. Yeah, because he's focused on drawing mm -hmm. <laughs> and not screwing around. Hi, 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 so I'm not really I don't have any references up right now so I don't know how his armor looks I, I've drawn I've drawn cloud before but it's not enough for me to go off my memory so what I'll do is I'll draw him naked don't <laughs> don't 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 need to blush just draw him naked that's right go right ahead this this stream is not for children okay matter of fact it's not really you know why because you swear a lot. Well, <laughs> well, no. Well, I was gonna say YouTube is, has all these new rules and regulations for when you when you are setting up your stream. They they ask you to set it like, is this for children or not? Oh, wow. I'm like, yeah, that's fair. I mean, can't we just have it for everybody? I mean, you have to be very um um specific with your your um help me out here do man i mean with your categories with your yeah they're they're like pipelining it a lot now they're cracking down on a lot of a lot of things nice plan on jumping on youtube one day eventually you will you will yeah. how old are you now it's just 24 i'm still 24. okay well remember we I was like 22. I'll, I'll tell you this. I got started when I was 23, okay? I think when I was 23. That's when I actually when I started my YouTube channel. I didn't actually get serious when I was 20, 25. So you'll have like one year left before you, you're too late, all right? Yeah. You start doing this late, and I'm going to kick you off the hangout. No longer, no. Like, you no longer can hang out unless you can you start your stream or your, your YouTube channel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's right. That's fair. See, here's the problem with my sketching style. I feel, I feel like this is my my uh, my problem is that there's too much there's too much stuff going on versus 
Uh, I really like the way Jimmy is able to just like keep it to like these one or two lines to represent so much information. And you don't get lost in it. This this tends to get me lost in the drawing and um, trying to draw too much information at once. I feel like my stuff can be a little too simple. I always look at your stuff and it's like, oh yeah, you good. <laughs> do you like usually have people ask you guys questions or you just kind of, huh just just do it just ask who do you usually like want your your uh viewers to ask you questions or you just kind of no i just, just, I just do my, that's the thing that's what i mean by like staying chill staying hungry mm -hmm. on the rock man i'm not gonna stop it's a man drawing i'm like oh, that and i wanted to do something a little more stylized oh look at that look at that hip <laughs> this pops up. oh no i was inspired man watching you help me help me go all right so so putting these sections imagining imagining if he was like a uh, um, a figurine doll, you know, get those separated muscles really all up in there, like, oof. You taught me how to make that noise, by the way. Okay. <laughs> 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 all right, it's gonna switch over to you and check out the uh, common boards. It's not really much. See now, that's what I'm talking about. I can't do that. This is all it. That's that's the key of your 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 your, your poses and your your sketching technique. It's key for creating a strong foundation. And if you can do this, sky's the limit. Sky's the limit. Yeah. I'm telling you. That, I'm telling you. That's that's the thing because it serves such a strong infrastructure. I'm in. Infrastructure, yeah. The underdrawing is so strong that whatever you lay on it, your eye can read really clearly. The strong, large shapes are easy. Like, you can just glance. Like, oh, pause. Mine's is a little messy. I mean, you know, it, it may be fancy and you may be like, you may like it, but it's like, it takes a second to, to, to figure out what's going on. There's a lot of mess. That's what I'm trying to say. Right. And then that, it takes more time. Unless you have the time to to flesh it out then it's not efficient you know so whereas um what you can do what you what you can do in an hour would take me three hours for say like for example um yeah you're just being nice you know we know you're amazing shut that Rawr! Yeah, beautiful mouth. Up. <laughs> <laughs> so lovely, so lovely. Um, but like, I draw hands like a certain way. Like I would, uh, yeah, tell just me. add a circle to where the hand would be. Right, and just connect. <laughs> That's what I was just saying. It's really nice, good for placeholders. Hands are great if you to because it it establishes not only the position of the hand. But for shortening, length of the arm, direction, um, oh, there's there's like three things I forgot. For, you can do like for shortening, um, the angle, and composition. I think angle composition. So a lot of times, like when I was first starting off, I remember like. Like, oh, getting the arm to look right, you know, drawing it from the shoulder down to the hand. It can start to feel stiff. And then if you want to change it, you're like, oh, my God, I have to start over. But then if you just lay down your hand first then, and work backwards, then it, you can already mm -hmm. feel where the, the what the arm is doing just by just by placing where the hand is. Exactly. Yeah. Bob says, wow, that drawing looks like me. Wow. You look like Mega Man. Got that Mega Man. Unless he's talking about your cloud drawing. No, no, no. Then... I'm on your screen. Oh, I see. 
If he looks like Cloud, then you can slide into my DMs. <laughs> slide my DMs. They're sliding my e DMs. Okay, yeah, I feel, I feel, I'm feeling this strong. Feeling it? We feeling it? We feeling it? Problem feeling with. It. Problem with my my drawing, I think. Um, and this is a real real problem. It's Cloud, and he has a really big sword, and I don't think anyone can hold a sword that easily out in that angle. It wouldn't make sense to hold a sword like that. It's not like a lightweight ass sword. It just doesn't feel. Right. It doesn't feel weighty if you have your arm out that way. You try to hold a sword, <laughs> or maybe he's just have it on the ground. Yeah, maybe like that. Okay, okay. He's dumb. He's dumb. See, he waste, wasting time with all this detail. What is that? Stop it. Amazing. Actually, I'm going to turn on my music, so I'm going to go back to you. Put I kind of want to do some foreshortening, but I think I'm okay. Yeah, this is one I overcomplicated. I'm just like, okay. Complicated, dude. Just get the fight. Just playing around. Don't expect too much, guys. No, it's lovely. Oh, yeah. The piece I was working on was uh this one. I think I showed it to you. Mm. And like, I just can't get like the freaking colors right. That's why I'm like, I'm just like specifically a line artist. I'm just not really good at colors at all. Um, where's the. Hmm. I feel like I lost a lot of drawings. It's weird. Can you see it? Can oh, yeah, it? yeah, yeah. Oh, so cute. Is that your girlfriend? Yeah. She looks like her. <laughs> nice. yeah. it's, just it's so funny. We tend to draw, we draw them in like a way like it resembles. Yeah, and then like, and they're like, "My God, you draw me too cute," and I'm just like, "Shut, shut your beautiful mouth." <laughs> Does Monk Becky always say that every time you draw? Her? Huh. And it's well, like when you draw, my friends used to always say like, "Oh, I, yeah, it looks like Boogie." All the time, all the, like, like every friend that I, I, I came across, was like you were drawing, that's that's boogie, isn't it? I'm like, and then she would just be like, no, there's <laughs> no. nothing like me. Because <laughs> that's how she talks. <laughs> yeah, I play around with the silhouette a lot when I draw. Yeah, just trying to find something that works. I'm gonna draw. I'm gonna draw. I'm gonna draw my hand just like yours. So circle hand. See, circle hand. No need to overcomplicate it. Just like the face, you can draw the the planes this way. So if it goes here and here, then you know that's the top plane of his hand. See? Wow! It doesn't have to just be like that. It can also be that this is the top plane, and he has his thumb like this. Bye. <laughs> See? <laughs> and yeah. you can also do his plane up facing where it's like this black yeah I mean bay like that see even playing like Yakuza <laughs> or something. Yakuza? Oh, Buggy yeah, plays, it. Buggy plays it. it, yeah. She beat that all by herself. I'm just like watching her play. There's like hostess clubs and stuff. She's like managing a bunch of <laughs> girls that looks like this. <laughs> Serving all these men. That's funny. <laughs> Oh, this is a funny pose. He's got his. He's got his. Um, I don't want that. 
But yeah, the options are there. You just lay, you lay the circle there and just it. Let me figure out what's the best one though. Mm -hmm. Just break it down into like you know, the palm and then the thumb. Flipping it will help me figure it out. Um, I'm trying to figure out what uh, what direction I want it now because I get those options. I'm gonna figure out what looks most appropriate for this pose. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to just cancel, throw away this post completely. Cause Ooh, I should post know. a link on my Instagram too, so I can just get some people who know me in here. <laughs> oh, wow. I think this backhand is the best. So you can see, I, I'm drawing lines to get these hands structures down. You can just draw that. Or you can draw the actual um, web hand group group the hands like this. Like that. Start to separate them. Blocky. This here. Hands can be tricky. Definitely. I've spent at least two hours on a single hand before. It's, it's not unusual to draw hands for two hours. Not unusual. Okay, so how do I add a link on on Instagram stories? I've never done this before. Well, I've never done it before either. I don't know if this is the time for that. Mm -hmm. Can't help you, bro. Man. You gotta figure it out. Shoot. This Shoot. Man is garbage. <laughs> Hey, that is a little better. <clears throat> nice balance. Man. Guys. Your guys look like girls, but it's nice. <laughs> <laughs> I say that to myself in my sleep. Man, what the hell? My guys look like girls. <laughs> <laughs> you wake up. What's wrong with you? You got to go Oh, sitting there. Cut it out. Oh my God. Oh my god. Let's try to draw the Barrett. The Barrett, the big old buff black dude. Barrett. Or Barrett. So first I'll start off with this skull. Nice. Nice powerful looking skull. Get that nice perspective already in there. Set it up, you know, because we're trying to do this in like a top down view. Everybody's like shouldered, shoulder to shoulder. You know, you know Barrett. You play? Have you played it? What game? Uh, Final Fantasy. Mm. No, I've only ever played like this before. This arm is On not good. There, it's gonna be blocking Barrett really. <laughs> or uh, Crystal Chronicles. This is like a new one coming out, which I'm pretty excited for. What? Which one? Crystal Chronicles? Chronicles, yeah, yeah. I played on a DS. That was really fun. And then on GameCube. Perspective is weird on this arm. Keep it simple. <laughs> Keep it simple, stupid. You gotta remind yourself. Yeah. It's fine. There we go. I use Jimmy technique. Woo! Jimmy technique. Jimmy technique. That's all we need to to uh, implicate a hand. Okay. Let's barrel chest. Big old barrel chest just to start off. Mm -hmm. I think there's any space for his arm if he was that close to him like that. Well, there's gotta be. This, yeah. So 
So we give him some space. We give him some space. Give him some space. We'll work on that perspective, okay? So imagine if he's a everything's just a box, one box. I'm used to drawing things in different perspectives. You can draw like that. His hand can do this with his gun arm. He's got a big old gun arm. Let's just keep it simple. Placeholders. I want to breeze through this, you know? My dream is to be able to breeze through things and just be like, looks good enough. <laughs> yeah. Let's, fuck it, good enough, you know? Like, as I spend like a good, I'd say 60% of my time undoing and being picky about something. If you can be like, it's there now. <laughs> good enough. Yeah. Can't change it. Goals. One of these days, <clears throat> excuse me, try to draw an entire drawing without erasing and just leaving all my garbage on there and no undos, just whatever I get is what I get. And then when it's done, you can look at it and go, well, next time, hopefully, uh, I won't make that those dumb moves. You know what I do? What? <clears throat> I turn off my express key for undo and I had to go undo it manually. But then I get too lazy to do it, so I just end up like just going with my drawing. <laughs> Wait, what? I uh, I don't have an express key for undoing, so I just kind of have to like move up and do it manually. But sometimes I get too lazy. So <clears throat> oh, so it makes it okay. Yeah, you're making it. Uh... I restrict myself. Yeah. What's the word? What's the idea behind that? I forgot. Um... Here, let me go back to you. There you go. It's not really anything. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry. Okay, what we have here, what you guys been saying this whole time? Wow, that drawing looks like me. <laughs> Which one? Is it? Is it Barrett? No. Uh, how many times do you? How many times? Do you did drawing until it finished? How many times do you, did you do the drawing in Um. There's no counting. There's just so many times. I usually have these place markers, like pack my eyes, especially when I'm animating, that helps. But then I just kind of go in and do it eventually. But then I said, my eyes are like really, really simple, so it doesn't really matter that much. Also, I've been practicing drawing on a like really high resolution because I don't know why. But I think it was mainly because of my computer because I got a faster. Like, mm -hmm. Oh, really? Like, it's like a lot easier. Yeah, I got like a lot of new equipment. And, nice. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so bad at saving. But uh, your little sister, my girlfriend, she uh, yeah, she just taught me how to like, save and like, oh. just do better with the movies. How little sis, really how 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 sis doing? She's good. She is actually being considered for a uh, a manager position at her workplace right now, and oh. she's only like like nineteen, so it's like oh, yeah. shoot, killing it. She's killing it. She's staying. Awesome. She's staying hungry. She moved out and got her own apartment with her best friend. So it's like, oh, yeah, it's great, man. That's... Is she still drawing? She draws from time to time. Let's get her. She says she wants a draw with us again let's she get her in here and draw man we were supposed to do that one but then like you guys disappeared we're gonna give you a whooping <laughs> little kids just running around disappearing yeah man 
And she got pregnant. It's just kidding. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Jimmy. I know, I know you got it in you. Congratulations, because you're an uncle. Now I'm going to have to beat your butt. Bob's your uncle. Oh, crap. Nah, we've been great, though. That's good. Good to know, man. Ain't no babies today. The final day. Le pa on down. Le pa. Nah, nah. Le pa on down. Le pa on down. I watched it the other day, and then I, ju I just started saying it all day. And they're like, why do you keep on saying that? And I'm just like, shut up. Mong Zia would know. You guys, if you guys have seen Waterboy, Le pa on down. Le pa. Day. Look, if you fail one day, yeah, fine, and then bang. Okay, that's all I'll say. If you failed your fight this day, yeah, fine, and then bang. Yeah, fine, and then bang. Excuse me. Yeah, fine, and then bang. Oh, I didn't get coffee, but um, I'm pretty hyped. Coffee. You drink coffee a lot? Um, not recently, no. Um, when I when I'm at conventions, yes. You kind of need it though, right? Oh yeah. Conventions ain't no joke. Conventions ain't no joke, man. We were we were in uh Chicago. That's supposed to be like three hours from you. Like six hours. Is it six? Still, yeah. Oh, I found okay. going. Cause there's no like all you can eat Korean barbecue joint here. For some reason, I so, thought you said three. I think I said six. Three hours. I think we're still in Minnesota. But it's three hours away. So. No, no. Um, I just might have, must have heard wrong. Mm -hmm. Perspective wrong. offsetting. See one one circular here, one circular here. It's like having this block of planes there. Matter of fact, this one might be a little too long. But. You know, they're bound on dying. Hey. 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 You been watching anything? You know, we started watching um Kingdom again. The season's just started and it's kind of it's kind of bad <laughs> that they the premise is all zombies and people getting affected and but it's like a really really good korean zombie movie set in uh, like um ancient not ancient but medieval medieval uh korea so so good if you like if you like game of thrones walking dead it's right up there. Probably even better because they got like awesome ass kung fu, taekwondo, jeet kundo. They're just like really action packed, really well polished. May I ask you why you have thirty eight? Oh, that's me. Yeah, I I don't like opening like another uh, another document. I just kind of sketch on the next layer so. and next layer, you know. Now draw each line on a different layer. So look, and I want to draw hand, her hand here, like like kind of clearing out her hair, but I'm like confused about it. Well, I would just do it like that. Okay, that's fine. I was gonna do a, a circle first. Right. right. That's enough. That's okay. Enough. She can be like, oh, my hair is in my eyeball. <laughs> I'm trying so bad right now. Oh, poke my heart. You're good, man. 
It's my heart. <sighs> what? You said, nah, it was lined up with Cloud's knee, man. You had it right. Corey! Corey! Corey Phillips says it was lined up with his knee. So I had it right. Are you drawing right now? Huh? Hmm? Huh? Do I have to go over there, reach inside that chat? Body slam you? <laughs> no, but thank you. I mean, um, it's because everybody's, um, everybody's on a different plane. They need space. They need that space. So they gotta have that space, see? It's not like, it's not like these two are like one, one organism where they have to line up like a box. They're offset as well, so they can be I mean, anywhere. I mean, you can drop them lower, but it's like technically they should be like really just. If I were to really exaggerate it, you can um, shrink it a lot more than that too. Because when you're looking down at an object, say the middle plane is here. Look, this is the middle plane. Wait, so let's let's do this here. Oh shoot. Okay, this here, and then. Let's say the plane is here. The bottom will be a more exaggerated line because it's further lower on the perspective. And this is technically not the center. So right now, this looks like the center. When in reality, the knee should be up here. If I really wanted to push perspective. And I can even draw his feet like super tiny here. Kind of deal. If I wanted to, I mean, it just it's just how how exaggerated you want. It's it's all an illusion and up to your interpretation. But if I were to draw a line here, it logistically looks like it should be there. But if you were to draw a center line from here to here, then the line should be here. So meaning, see how this this area is much shorter than this. And the more you get, the more the lower you get, the more condensed it gets. So the space it takes you for me to get here, let's see here. Look, I mean, look at the. I'm drawing these perspective lines by eye, but look at this side here. It gets even more narrower and more ex extreme. It went from this line to this. It should be even tighter here, so. Progressively more and more um, exaggerated. So the proportion from here to here, it's it's almost half. You don't want that. You want to have like a nice, nice tapering of you know tapering of that shape, so that you can really push that perspective. Does that make sense? Hope that makes sense. I need to practice that a little a little more. Really, really rusty on that. Just good exercises. Just try to draw um, body parts, hands, torsos, heads in boxes in in a different angle, and try your best to draw like a face in there. And after a while, you kind of get the the feel for how which like. What up, Daisuke Uchiha? Good to have you guys here. Welcome to the show. We're drawing. We're drawing a little bit today for you today. All right, I'm gonna take a break here. Drawing a little bit today for you today. <laughs> That's your OC. <laughs> John, today a little bit for you today. May I ask? Oh, so. Are uh, making your characters look the same? Okay. Mickey asks, does anyone? Have advice for making characters look the same every time i draw my style looks different characters don't look the same you gonna answer that tell them i'm gonna draw i mean for me personally i had a similar issue but like it's like you just kind of go off like what feels good when you're just like illustrating and which is fine but if you're really trying to like get like a set character design uh you just you just gotta really break down what you're doing instead of just kind of 
like let's say like i know a friend of mine he would do the same thing where his style just changes all the time and then i'll ask him like why he made that decision and he'll be like oh because it you know i thought it looked cool which is which is right it does look cool but do but like when you're choosing shapes it kind of has to match overall um like your shape language like if you're using a lot of curves making like more rounded disney shapes you're not just gonna like throw in like some really jagged like anime shapes mm. out of nowhere you kind of have to follow the whole contour of uh your shape language and stuff uh... And then it could possibly be because you're drawing too small. I'm trying to draw bigger, like think of like the overall silhouette before you start making. Nice tip. Ooh. That's me. I, like that. I used to have I used to have a stimulation when I was I like starting that. out. What do you, What do you have tips? Like, what are your tips for it? Keeping people looking the same. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Aside from practice, you know, that's a close keep, common keep, Keeping them looking the same for me, uh, if, it, if it's not in anim, anime style or manga style, it's... It's not right. Um, it all... I think exaggerated features is good. Because when you have exaggerated, you have great, like larger landmarks to, to base your features off of. So when you're... Say Santa Claus, for example. Big, big old beard, ball nose. It's a lot of features that you can just go off and it's easy to fake to, to yeah it has like a collective shape language yeah it's already there. it's pretty distinct in you know in overall shape yeah um but anime tends to be quite subtle in features very subtle and a lot of the characters look similar you have the same face syndrome a lot of times right. um right. and sometimes it's fine because it's it's a stylistic preference um, you have like an idealized face that you kind of like to like to jump to um, but as far as drawing faces similarly you can also draw things in grids it's kind of how concept artists do things just draw a face um, in three views the front side and front side or even four One side and three quarter, I think. I say this is the side view and then the front view. Just like, ugh. Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep. Beep, beep, boop. See, this was already wrong. See this line right here? Let's just say that. Symbolically, actually, let's just use this for an example. Let's say this is one of the features of the character. His nose is here, so the nose lines up here, right? So if his nose is way up here, then that's where the nose should start here. And if it ended here, then that's where it ends over here. And you just draw a line right next to each other. And base off of this weird nose feature, that's where he should be. And that's his character. And say if he was like some some brute, brutish looking Viking character, which this art kind of reminds me of, then it's kind of where... <laughs> I would place that and say like his hairline for example his hairline. his hairline choosing where his hairline is could could make a big difference it's really thin up there you know if it was like <laughs> it's just like little little uh features like that have them all lined up and that's but having a very distinct um overall character design is gonna make like like this guy here this dude's head is not gonna be uh, mistaken for her or him or you know maybe maybe uh Barrett but yeah hopefully you guys can take away from that little maybe five dollars five dollars it's the background music.
So this playlist that I have on right now is actually the playlist from my uh, last edited um, video, and it's a lot of just copyright free music. You cannot get away with any of this stuff if you're playing copyrighted music. They will cut you midstream, and I've had that happen before in the past, so I learned my lesson. Jeez. Yeah. As a matter of fact, my my uh, first stream that I did two days ago, it got copyright stricken. I was like, oh shoot. So whatever bit of uh, monetization I can get on that video, it's no longer possible. It no, no longer goes to me. But it's like five cents. I get like five cents a video. Like not even a joke. <laughs> Oh, you just turned the moon. <laughs> hey, when's your when's your birthday? It is coming up. Is it just April, like your is it April eighth? Uh, no, April close. April six. April six. Yeah. So funny. You got the same birthday month yet. We do. Let's go back to this dude. I really want to like just breeze through it so I can actually have something, a semblance of a finished piece for a stream like a, and be like, yeah, this is what I would call finish. There you go. I want to get you one more time. Well, Barrett has a... Has like a... Sunglasses. That was really good. Thank you. Perspectives. Mm. <laughs> Psych. Mm. You feel like you leveled up, though? Huh? Uh, how, how much do you feel like you leveled up, like, since like, the last time we've drawn together? Do I feel like I've gotten better? Yeah. No, how I'm, much do you, how I much think you leveled up? Since the last... I don't think I got that. I think I... Stagnated. Because I stopped drawing as much. The last time I was drawing with you, I was doing like daily sketches. So, it took, but it's like my third day of streaming, so I'm like a little bit loosened up right now. That's true. Um, but again, I'm drawing guys. I'm not a problem with drawing guys, man. So we started drawing. At 9.30? That was the beginning of the stream. It's 11.30 for me. Okay, okay. Yeah, when you said 9.30, I was like, oh, snap. Oh, right, 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 right. This, this, this. 11.30 for you.
that drawn there. Yeah, sometimes I feel like I'll, I'll regress. You know, sometimes I'm like stagnant. I'm like not improving. Yeah. Um, feel yeah. the same way. Been watching any anime? Oh yeah, there's a question about anime. Um, no, uh, Demon Slayer. I watch Demon Slayer. That's awesome. That's true. I love Demon Slayer. You watch Demon Slayer? No, I haven't watched it yet. Oh, wee. <laughs> <laughs> those vocals, man. <laughs> wee. You gotta watch that Demon Slayer. That Demon Slayer. Um, yeah, I love Demon Slayer. I get excited because it's one of those enemies that it's really mm -hmm. nice. It it starts to get really shonen y. Like typical shonen y with all the slapstick and lighthearted humor. I'm like, come on, oh, stop with the lighthearted stuff, man. You were doing so good. It was so dark and nice. Dark. It is shiny. I was like, you're so, 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 got like nice, serious, dark tone to it. I'm like, wow, okay, this, this is serious. This, okay, this is not like, like cheesy, serious, like kind of Attack on Titan. Like, hey, let me throw this in your face. First episode. No. No. Attack on Titan is fun to watch, though. I like it. First, uh, first, first couple episodes up to like, up until like episode seventeen, I stopped because it started to get into like filler, like stop progressing. I'm like, mm -hmm. I hate when shows do that. You can just see it, and they're not even hiding it. It's just like, and we're locked in the cages for another three days. What? What? Yeah, I haven't really been watching like any action. Like this is one called a uh, hands off the. Motion Pictures Club, which is pretty funny. Hands off the who? Hands off the Motion Pictures Club. It's about animation. Like it's about like a team. Oh, um, as far as uh, no, I'll let you finish. But yeah, I've watched the movies. But yeah, go ahead. Yeah, it's pretty cool, and I've been watching Haikyuu, the volleyball. Oh, anime. I started it. I started it. I don't know. This season feels like it's lacking a lot compared to like like the quality of all the other ones. Oh. It's not really. It's not really there. Got you know, starfish hair. I'm gonna pull up his reference. I don't know how his hair actually works. Damn it! It's making it up because I try. I used to always try to do his hairstyle back in the day, mm -hmm. when I was like thirty pounds lighter. <laughs> what? Yeah. 30 pounds lighter. <sighs> yeah. Tell him. Tell him you lost hella weight too. Yeah. You lost hella weight, guys. So I lost hella weight. Yes. <laughs> I don't think they really care. I lost it. Healthily. It's something to be proud of, though. I mean, yeah. it's old news now, but you didn't. You it's did. kind of frustrating when, like, accomplished a huge feat like that my sister, like she's still trying to use like weight loss tea and i just tell her that this stuff doesn't work and she like but but they sell it and i'm just like oh, okay and I, I don't even try to like talk about it anymore I just kind of let them do whatever they want when it comes to that so but aside from that i don't know i feel like it did help me draw better your job no i'm just losing weight but i feel like i cleaned think a lot more clearly but let me see they said you do be vibe no magic okay so Cinetic Cinetic said how much weight yeah I lost uh, I went down 350 to 190 whoa you you're 190 no huh? yeah I'm like hovering around like two 210 now. Okay, okay, okay. But you got to 190. Oh. <gasps> what the hell? I thought you were like the last, the last, the lowest I heard you get was like two, 220, I think. And then 
Hot was you were like, and I was like, I was like, yeah, you can do 180, and you're like, that's impossible. Yeah. And, I was, and then like, I was looking like really toned, like, but it was uh, oh, they couldn't eat whatever I want, so okay, I just you went from like, three, three, I, three, what now? Three, three fifty. You went to three fifty. Yeah, I mean, I can post my Instagram in there. Yeah, yeah, yes, he shows his uh, transition. I mean, it's those transitions that that will blow your mind away. It's not the kind of like, oh yeah, he lost some weight. No, he lost like it looked like he had like like surgery, kind of like he had his stomach stapled. But I don't think you, you can even afford a stomach surgery. I don't know. <laughs> Wayne, like that. I mean, like, I'm pretty sure everybody who's been that big has thought about it, but then once you do your research, it's just kind of dangerous. Yeah. Unhealthy. And that's and you've been big your whole life too. Yeah, so it's it's kind of weird. Like, I don't know. I don't know if they want me to digress. What's on it my called? Life. Jimmy Jimmy draws. Which... Jimmy draws. Jimmy draws. I don't have a YouTube. I know I'm not allowed to post uh, my Instagram on there, am I? Or what? Yeah, you are. Okay. Yeah, I'm on Instagram. I don't have a YouTube, like, one day. But, yeah, my, my, I feel like my drawings, like, I'm not really doing well right now. But if you just go back and see my Instagram, it, it shows a lot, a lot of stuff. Well, a decent amount of stuff, anyways. You just scroll down, you can see, like, a picture of my weight loss. Yeah. Right next to the picture of me at one of my biggest meeting my favorite animator. So. Oh, Yosh, Yoshinari. Yoshinari. Yeah. I'm not sure if you've seen him, Mungjet. But yeah, you I just saw go it. down. I saw it. So funny. Yeah. And he's probably like, who's this chunky, chunky little little kid? It doesn't even look like it, which is crazy. Like, because I stayed inside too and I, like, I lightened up. Because that summer I was outside a lot. So are you able to mm -hmm. maintain that? Um, how long the journey was it? I honestly, I lost it pretty fast, and then like at an alarming rate, and then the doctor said I was actually fine. But uh, I lost it like most of the weight, in like, like eight months. So, yeah, I was losing like twenty pounds, fifteen twenty pounds a month. And how did you do it? Just exercise. I did a lot of like like different dieting tactics like nothing crazy mm -hmm. but uh, our phase we were like fasting all the time yeah and then that helps like that helps clear my mind but i just did normal uh like moderate to low carb i don't think you should cut out carbs i think you should cut out sugar like almost mm -hmm. completely if you're looking to lose weight but like you know people say like don't eat rice makes you fat like anything makes you fat <laughs> yeah and you know, there's a whole insulin and all that stuff thing. But as if you're young, I don't think like keto is not the the best thing you can do. Yeah, 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 yeah absolutely. If, you have, like, if you're a lot older and you have like you know your your insulin is like not as controlled because you're older. Uh, okay, I posted it, but I guess they don't see it, Mojin. Okay, well, link me then. What's it? Just your 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 Instagram. I'll just pull it up. Yeah. Keep drawing. I'm gonna I'll go to your Instagram. It's I, not that's how we teamwork. Yeah. You gonna draw? Okay. I'm gonna go look. Yeah. JB Fried Rice. That's right. Not not JB draws. It's JB Fried Rice. JB draws. It's JB Fried Rice, right? Yeah. There he goes. This is my man. So this is JB. The JB. Wait, no, I gotta switch back. I forgot. There we go. <laughs> Hi, JB. Can't see your screen on the the Google Hangout. No, you can't. Like, I, mean, I, can't but I just can't see them. I can share you via stream. It's just when I'm drawing, I don't want to because it, it'll lag me out. Okay. So I'm, but while I'm showing the screen, you can talk about it. That's kind of what I was talking about with Alex last night. It's like, boom. boom. <laughs> I wish it was better. <laughs> Monkey taught me a lot. Like, you can see, like, I, I hit I, like archived a lot of the old stuff, but like I had like a big jump in level in like like two months. Hmm. Yeah, that's just my I did a cover photo for uh oh, yeah. my YouTube channel. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Very clean. Very clean. That's great. Yeah, I just created like an OC to use. Kinda like your monkey. GB fried rice, yeah. 
Yeah, yeah we're all a bunch of monkeys, Cambodians. Yeah. That's my girlfriend and her Pokemans. Oh, it's so good. And then... Hell yeah. And there are you with your Pokemans. Yeah. Oh, this is so adorable. <laughs> that is so adorable. Man. Yeah, I did that. It's so you guys do. <laughs> Some stuff. You can see my animations. I'm not sure if it's like lag. It, on here? This is animation? No, not that. Like, uh. Go down. That was fun. I like that one. That was fun too. Monster Hunter people? Yeah. Are you still playing Monster Hunter? Yeah. I play it a lot still. Yeah. Sketch is that, phase. Is that why you're... I, I, I like the sketches on that right there. Yeah, I love this. This is a great place to stop and just... Um, well, that looks like you're cleaning up your lines with sketch underneath. <laughs> um, but a good, good place to stop to like start painting and keeping like things loose. But yeah. Oh, yeah, right here. Mm -hmm. uh, Yoshinari. That's, that's when you were how old? This is just last year. I was only 23. 23. That was last year. Yeah. And this is this year. I don't know. I actually don't remember. Was I 24 or 23? I you, think I was still 20. It was about two, it's about two years ago now because you, you were you were grinding last year. It was when you were really working on the way yeah. you lost. I was doing like a bunch of commissions and like dumb stuff. And then I just kind of like. If money wasn't really an issue, so I just felt like drawing my own thing. <laughs> yeah. I remember this one. <laughs> Go show them the before and after picture. Did you oh. click on it yet? Wait, what? Right there. This one? Yeah. Oh, oh, this? This one here? Yeah. Oh, wait. I'm looking at the wrong stream. I was looking at your, um, the, the YouTube. I was, I was like, off by a few seconds. Oh. Uh, yeah. That one oh, was you're fun. Talking about the, you're talking about the, uh, the actual. Yeah. The, yeah, yeah. That was, uh. That's right. That's it. right, children. That's right, children. There it is. Right. That's crazy, right? Crazy. That's, that's yeah. what we call crazy. I mean, every single day he was at the gym, just running, doing ellipticals, was it? Just running. <laughs> I don't know what you were doing, but... And then you were just cutting... Cutting so much weight, man. Yeah. It was, it was crazy. Yeah, so... Oh, here's the Yeah, so... That's all from his brain. So, Jibby... Jibby's a, an animator. Have, like, it's only, like, a couple animations. But uh, like a, a lot of missed opportunities too. Yeah. I don't really like talking about it, but I guess I don't mind talking about it on the stream. Just sure, uh, you don't you don't have to. We just no. I think it's a good lesson to learn, cause I, I feel like I deal with uh, anxiety. Like I think I'm just gonna fail. Yeah. And then that's insane. Uh, I had like an opportunity to animate for Castlevania of season three. Yeah. I let like my nerve get the better of me, so I just kind of told him that like, I don't feel like I'm up for it, which like in retrospect I think that was. But yeah, watching yeah. it, I was like, I think they need a Jimmy on the team. <laughs> just saying. Yeah, and then that's all. Uh, it was kind of rough. I was like, this is this is beautiful, bruh. And now you're just like all handsome. <laughs> Job. Look at my hair. I just woke up and I'm like, oh. <laughs> Wait, you, you've gotten rid of a lot of pictures, it seems. Yeah, I did. It was uh, a lot of weird stuff. I just wanted to, like. Yeah. Just clean up a little. Yeah. Gotcha. But <laughs> someone asked, is that a smushed cat? And I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> that's a. I was a, <laughs> that was a bunny rabbit. Oh. I just kind of walked past it and I was like, wow. Ooh. It's like still. I'm not sure how long it was there, but I didn't. I didn't want to archive that. I thought it was kind of uh, morbid, but kind of funny at the same time. <laughs> All right, uh, there's that. What a journey! I do have a Twitter. Same thing. Like, I posted some from animations, and then um, it just get, freaking got popular, and that's where I got the job for oh, to which, do custom for the for the uh, the the witch girl, the broom girl. Yeah, that one freaking went crazy. So that's when you got, got the call for the... I got attention for it, yeah. Castlevania. And recently, which I uh, I got a, a job to work on Boruto. Boruto? 
burrito. Yeah, but what happened? Hmm? Oh, it's just a lot of communication, like, barriers. It's so weird, because then I'll ask him, like, can you send me to drive? And then he wouldn't respond for a few days, and I'm just like, the deadline's closing in, and I'm like, oh, my God. And then he'll respond, and I don't know what he's saying, because he's all like, like, thank you for waiting. And I'm like, what did you send? I don't see anything. Is it Japanese? Japanese, yeah. And it's, it's, a, it's a lot of, like, I don't know what's going on with, like, the animation industry but they're like outsourcing a lot like he's an outsourced animation director which is really weird considering you know to have quality control it's best to kind of like in-house semi in-house but he's like he's like a, a freelancer doing animation directing which is kind of weird because they usually have in-house people doing animation oh, directing. yeah freelancing the animation director i haven't watched burrito is it good well you shouldn't say if you feel whatever just it's good it's good it's it's there's only one episode that I, a lot of my my didn't like not i was like friends but people i like we associate we associate each other like with uh animation and yeah. stuff they worked on world to 65 which i'm pretty sure everybody knows it was like that crazy scene where they uh recreated the, the fight from the movie mm -hmm. and i wish i worked on that but you know that was, that was pretty cool. He means by the actual show. Yeah. yeah. Jibby's an up, yeah. up and coming animator, living living icon right now. <laughs> nah, yeah, I kind of want like, That's right. like, edge. No, 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 no. Just kind of show how like how easy it is to get into the industry nowadays because of its decline. So you can actually like get to a decent level in just about like a couple years. And then start working on anime, but just don't expect to get paid so much. They kind of like ride on the fact that it's a passion project. Mm -hmm. Naruto, Naruto has amazing Sakura, like Naruto. But I, I wouldn't say Boruto has like like two percent of the show has Sakura. Same and Naruto, like that's where I like got my start because I remember when I was a kid, I first saw like Rock Lee versus Gara. And that's like the first time I've ever seen anything like that. And it just kind of blew my mind. And then... Oh, yeah. How old were you? Kind of, kind of stuck with me. I was only like 10. Oh, my God. I was like 20... 20-something 20 already. <laughs> yeah. yeah in terms of like... Yeah. It's, it's runtime. Naruto has low percentage. But I feel like... It was, it was really fun. It was really, it was really good. When you just think about that and just kind of ignore all the filler, it had really, really iconic stuff. Right? Ain't nobody got time for passion project. Passion projects. It's kind of like you just oh, passion projects. At, at a certain point, like just trying to make a living, man. I'm trying to like trying not to eat. waste. My, trying to, yeah, like you know, you you. It's fun to do, but you know, I'm old. Like I'm, I'm hitting like 25 now, and I gotta like, I would rather just work on my own stuff, and like not get paid for it than to like grind on something for so long and like barely get paid for it. Yeah, that's the yeah. spirit, man. It's not. That's the spirit. Yeah, it's not fair what they do to us though. It's not fair. Cause you know, they say like animators get paid crap in Japan. Like, imagine if you're an outsourced animator for those people, <laughs> you get paid even less. Oh, damn. Yeah, I wasn't really thinking about it when I saw the Sasuke versus Rochimaru because I don't know, but then. When I backtracked and watched it again, I'm like, oh my god, like this this scene has like sick animation too. What what? what? And oh, Mickey it was, says, that, that was animated by the same guy who animated um, Naruto versus Sasuke yeah. at the, the waterfalls, and like episode like 134 or something like that. Norio Matsumoto, he's really good, like one of my inspirations. And then, yeah, I kind of looked up to his work for a while. Still kind of do. But he's been semi low key. Your Mickey says, How often do you draw? Hey, it's Yev son. Yev. What's up, Yev? Yev's an upcoming artist as well. We know Yev. 
No, oh, Matsumoto is amazing. How often do I draw? Uh, not as much as I should be. <laughs> How often did you used to draw? Oh, like for like six, seven hours a day. I kind of want to get back to that, but like, like I've never had a girlfriend before. <laughs> but she, she encourages me to draw. Like my girlfriend bought me a Cintiq and she's amazing. And she's like, you better put this to good use, you lazy fuck. <laughs> no. Uh, That's fine. Yeah, she should watch it 100%. And like while I'm drawing, yeah. she'll just like do her own thing. She'll draw too, or she'll just like, you know, do her homework or play games. Ryo Matsumoto. Ryo Matsumoto. Yeah, he's, he's, he's epic. He's, he's up there. Okay, so this is not going to go on for much longer, this stream. Probably 30 more minutes. Apparently, Boruto isn't that good, so if I were in your shoes, I'd go for it. Like, yeah, I understand. I would... I. It was just... It was just a lot of like, it was like stress early on. And I just imagine like, oh, what if you sent it back? And there's more communication, like errors and barriers. And like, I just didn't want to deal with that too. But I just know there's a lot more opportunities. So I'm not, it's not really like a missed opportunity, like that big. But I feel like Castlevania, like uh, Samuel Dietz, the guy who directed the most of the series. He's actually, he's really cool. Like, I like talking to him. He's like a really nice guy. And I just kind of felt like I let him down. And then, I don't know. Hopefully, hopefully he'll have me on again. Aww. And by that time, I'm ready, ready. He'll be ready. Also, the thing when the shadows disappear and the colors kind of get you know saturated. I mean? Yes. Oh, yes, son is my boy. He knows what's up. Yeah, I love it when they, like, I mean, I don't know. They, I feel like they have better like color compositors for uh, for certain episodes because like like just the color harmony is just way better, and I think just on top of that is just better drawing skills too. So there's no like confusion of where the shadows should go. They already know where the shadows and everything should be, should be, and it all works pretty uh, cohesively. What were you gonna say, Mungjae? Sorry. No, that's no, okay. Um... I was gonna say, um, I totally forgot. I don't even know. That's to do with animation. Animation. Yeah, like, I'm in this, like, Discord, and we're, like, all a bunch of, like, non Japanese animators. A lot of Indonesian, Filipino. A lot of Indonesian animators. That's one thing I learned. Mm. And uh, for the most part, it's, like, They're like, we're all just pretty young. Like a lot of them originated from like stick figure animation too. So they have like really good sense of timing, but like oh. semi, semi like <laughs> subpar sense for drawing, which is not like bad, honestly. Like, cause like I've seen like, yeah, I don't want to talk down some artists, but like, uh, I remember when like Dave Raposa made like this animation. And I just thought it would look really, really weird uh, because he, he didn't really have a sense for like timing. Yeah, he's more of an illustrator. Yeah. And then these ad, these stick figure animators who just drew stick figures most of their lives, like starting to like actually learn like figures and stuff. Yeah. Their stuff goes like they're really freaking good. Timing, huh? Yeah. Like, and because they draw so much and they enjoy it, like they don't spend too much on each drawing, they level up really, really fast. I used to animate. I wish I used to freaking animate it more. <laughs> you go, you go, you go, you go, wind up right here. You go like this, wind up. You get the punch here. Mm. Right? And then the next one, you pull back a little bit right here. And then that's the anticipation. You hold that for one key. <laughs> and then you yes. swing it in right here. And you follow through. You go right here. Snap right there. No, this is like a stretch, a little stretch, squash and stretch right there. And you snap it right back into place right here, the last one. And it's like, so pop! That's a punch right there. Feel me? Yes. <laughs> I hope you saw us. 
<laughs> Not sorry. Back in the it's day, like, back in the day, that's it's like so a little follow through, and then um, snaps a pap. Anyways, hope that made sense. Would have rather had screen caps of one version of the manga. Yeah. A lot of people were really disappointed of season two. I just kind of like people get really mad when it's like anybody talks about it. Like everyone knows it's not as good as season one. Let me just kind of just Ooh. leave it like that. Yeah, season one's nice. What do you mean, uh, Castlevania? What are we talking about? Here? One Punch Man. <laughs> Castlevania. What? You're talking about One Punch Man. What? Oh yeah, One Punch Man. It's still nice. It's just yeah, this animation just took a hit, and also. The details of the characters. Yeah. It started to use like, 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 like gradients that weren't there before, like like yeah. genos. Yeah. What are they doing with the gradients? <laughs> what were you thinking? And then it's and then like once they got like I saw like the studio lineup and I'm like okay. JC staff is the animation studio that worked on it and their stuff is good like, but they're not they're not like an action studio animators like. Damn it, they did mostly like so. they did like Bakuman, like that one anime about like drawing manga and stuff. Yeah. And that, that anime like mostly has like still frames, so I'm like, okay, they were able to pull that off because of because it wasn't really like yeah. too intense. But like when it, they gave it to them, I was like, no, I'm not, I'm not sure. Like, and lo and behold, you know. Yeah. yeah. But I'm not really one to complain. Like I heard this one girl at a hot topic heard me like say one thing, and then she's like, "Well, it's better than nothing." And I'm just like, Ugh, "I don't like what people say." That. <laughs> what what is One Punch? One well, Punch season two. I'm like honestly wish they would just waited another year or two. I don't really care. Yeah. You want that? You want that top of the line? This is one of all star cast cash animators. Animation. I, I liked it. I liked it. I enjoyed it. It was it was a good story for me. It, I mean, it was it wasn't like how how the first season was. It was everything was standalone episodes. It just was more straightforward. Like, yeah, I mean, like I think first season was on a, on a level on its own. It was really epic. Every episode was just like, whoa, wow, like what the what the hell? The whole time you're just screaming. So good, so good. I need to look up Cloud's outfit. I forgot how it is. You excited for the remake for Final Fantasy VII? Yeah, yeah. So I decided to draw some Final Fantasy again. I'm gonna look up some outfit designs from him. No color, I'm just gonna sketch today. Hopefully season three is good, at least most of season two content is like build up to the monster arc, but they yeah, killed really the studio like, fight. Drop something amazing. Mob Psycho 100 though, I'm not really disappointed by that. Have you seen Mob Psycho? No. Okay. I watched the first episode. I watched it twice. Oh. It's so funny. Like it. Okay, got some of my outfit stuff going on here. thing here all right I'm gonna I think I'm gonna turn off this music after this song 
well, what's the point? I was thinking like if I have the same song on over and over because there's like it's uh it's on a loop and there's only like five or six songs because I don't want to have like a whole large playlist to have in the description because I have to cite all these songs when I play them I can't just play them so I've only got like five songs playing and that may be a little bit that may be a little tedious for some people who are watching like man some people just watch have it on the background and have to like keep hearing the same songs like they're probably listening to their own music too yeah so that's why like... that's why to like turn it off. Let me know if you guys mind the music or want it off in the future. I like it though. I mean, it has some sound because being super quiet it's just, can be a little nerve wracking. So I put out this uh, tweet basically if you guys wanted to showcase your artwork or art store this is supposed to supplement or substitute the uh, artist alley that got cancelled for ECC but I just feel like the reach of this show isn't that big at all so not very many people realize it's even going on so they're just like what's the point kind of nah man I tried look at the comments Oh no, you guys are watching me draw. Good thing. Yeah. This is gonna be some more season two content. Like build up to the monster art, but they kill the so Mob is good. Yeah. Mob is amazing. Hey, don't mind. I don't really complain. Okay, I think um, it's eleven fourteen. We start nine thirty. It's been. Hey, I'm gone. Got nervous. I'm sorry, guys. Hope you forgive me. Yeah, I I can I get nervous sometimes too, man, or just like get frustrated. Yeah. I was just like frustrated because I'll practice more like I mean I'll, I'll shake off the rust by tomorrow and I'll draw a lot faster or something yeah if you'll have me you got so fast I mean the very beginning you're just like knocking them out I was like blasting them blasting them Yeah, Yev knows about animators. I want to ask him about what, what his favorite animators are. Or her, I'm not sure. I 
think I would cut off the piece from there. One more time. This bigger shape right here looks weird because it's in a perspective and how it fans out all of a sudden doesn't feel right. Just doesn't feel right. Oh, he has a pants that goes all the way here. See, these shapes is hard because his pants does this like genie thing where it's like this. At the base, it's bigger. But since it's in perspective, it's got to do that. So it's supposed to taper, get smaller, but then the pants itself is supposed to be puffing out the base. So I'm like, ugh. That looks so weird. <laughs> I'll just keep it like that for now. I'm not even going to think about that. <laughs> it's going to be weird for Barrett. That's so weird. Hmm. Yeah, so if his legs go there, he's that tall. <laughs> it's not gonna work. <laughs> yes, Sam says. Well, I'm not actually that well versed in all the Sakuga people in animation industry. Matsumoto's probably my favorite, but I don't know enough other ones. Okay, that's fair. Probably pretty obscure. Like, he's not really anything. But you know when you see it, you'd be like, oh, I don't love that animation. Remember that one episode of Baron Logan? Remember that one episode of One Punch Man? And I'll just be like, yeah, that's this guy. Or you didn't know that was this guy? All right, I think that's that's it for me because I'm gonna I'm just gonna not stop if I keep going. I mean, you can still just chat and hang out, but if you want to, yeah, yeah it's definitely, definitely, I'm gonna do that. Just put it on, put it on me, put the spotlight on me, boys. Um, as far as the stream goes, I don't, yeah, I don't want it to run on like ongoing forever, nonstop. Be like. That's fair. Yeah. Fair enough. But I'll definitely chill with you. Le pa na day. Le pa na day. Le pa na day. Le pa na day. All right, guys. I'm gonna call this night. Let's see what we got here. Mickey Tay Tally E. You have some Cenetech. Hey, you have some long streams. Long streams aren't bad though, Jet. A lot of artists, I think, prefer longer streams. No. I think artists definitely do. And people who just like having it on the background for sure, I, I think so. But I think like these for, people on right now, they really don't mind. For, for logistic, yeah. For a logistic standpoint, on, on terms of like having videos in my playlist and being like, this one's four hours, this one's five hours, this one's four, it becomes like a whole set of videos that. You say if you wanted, you had a piece of information that you felt valuable, that was valuable, and somebody wanted to find something. It's gonna be hard to just sift through and say, well, "When did they say that?" And I'm sure, when did they pull that up? You know, when I was, whenever I try to find something, I, I do or say, I can't because the videos are too dang long. 
too too dang long. Too dang long. But if you can condense it to like an hour or even like, even like, well, streams can't be any shorter than an hour, I think. But if you can get that to an hour, then you can really like have, um, like nuggets of of fun things that you can pick and pull from and be like, oh yeah, that's this episode talks about this. But if every yeah. single one drags them on, then it becomes just just a hangout that is, session. That that, is true. For hangout sessions, I think that's more for Twitch. Like, if you just want to hang out, you know, it's like nobody's really digging into the archive and trying to figure stuff out. But for YouTube, I feel like I like to try to keep them shorter. <laughs> I'm learning. I'm learning how to slowly, slowly cut back. We did four, four. I think we did five, five hours, 20 minutes the first night. I had to trim it down, post-editing. Sort of. First stream. But, yeah, we're going to keep drawing. I hope you guys had fun. Vin sense, thank you guys. Con art, you guys were really active in the in the chat, and we really appreciate that. It's my home, is my family. It's always nice that we we can like bounce off of your like conversations and questions and things. Thanks. Yeah. And uh, yeah, that's the uh, this day 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 two day three day three. Is it day three? No, day two. Yeah, day two of the Arlie Artist Alley series. Oh, let's do a quick shout out to somebody. Who, uh, one of my buddies who was supposed to be at ECC um, was uh, Iron Pinky. Check him out, you guys. You guys might already know who he is. He's a uh, nice. Iron Pinky is. One of the udon artists, one of the uh, pretty pretty well known udon artists who draws um, like Street Fighter characters, Capcom characters, um, but he's he's doing the con circuit and stuff, kind of like me, and um, but he's been doing it way way longer before me, and um, how much do you guys make from it? Like a decent amount? Oh, I don't. Well, yeah, we do we do a pretty good living, make a pretty good living, definitely enough to not work work for other clients like. This is a full time job. Okay. Um, uh, let's see. Yeah, this is Iron Pinky. Oh, Lord Raptor from Darkstalkers and Ken. So awesome. So awesome. Wait, am I sharing my screen? Make sure, uh, make, sure no. on, make sure on OBS. I'm on your screen. I'm so dumb. Good thing, I, so good thing I caught that. Okay, yeah. Here we go. Iron Pinky. Yeah, he was supposed to be going to ECC. C as well um and the funniest thing is is that um i followed his work for a long 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 time and then we kind of just our paths kind of connected or crossed when we when i started doing conventions and then now he lives in sacramento too so it's like we're a local artist like we we uh support your local artists <laughs> we live near each other it's so crazy but yeah I was a fan of his work growing up, like growing up way back, like when I first started Demon Art, just like following people, you know, and like you'd never think you'd meet them, and all of a sudden you're like you're talking to them and hanging out with them right. at you never, conventions. You, you, you just, you're just like a, you know, a casual watcher just, of just your stream, watching not. your cypher streams at like 18, 19 years old. Yeah. You never think you'd be friends with them. <laughs> sounds like, sounds like a, something you want to share with us. Yeah. Is there is there is there a story you want to tell? <laughs> no, me JB Fry Rice, brother. JB's uh, my little brother, man. He's been he's been around for a while, but um, uh, yeah. So Iron Pinky, he was supposed to be at ECC. Check his art artwork out. He has a store as well. Um, let him know I sent you guys. If not, give him a follow. Just be like, hey, man. <laughs> yeah. Follow me. Lovely, lovely work. This is one. Of, this is probably my all-time favorite piece. It's Power Stone. Oh, I love Power Stone. Oh, I think I, I've seen it before. Yeah. The Bomo. He's quite incredible. Quite incredible. Work ethic off like next level. Right. Very yeah. incredible. Happy birthday. There he is, Mister, Mister Pinky. Look at this. This is yeah. This is my one of my other favorites. These group, these group panels, the group group pieces, insane. His compositions are just they're just like so juicy. Like mm -hmm. they make so much sense. They just like swirl around and do all these things. It's just 
anytime people do these huge ass murals for characters I'm just like fuck I die, I die just looking at it like <laughs> yeah but yeah that's it that's the artist alley number number two so that's what we that's what we're doing that's what we do here we share art and uh, hope you guys spread the love and if you have any art you want to share just go ahead and tweet out uh, Emerald what was it artist yeah no, Alley Stream. Pound um, hashtag Alley Stream, and I'll look it up and see if you see if uh, I'll shout it out. Cause I don't think I got a single shout out of anybody. So, what's going on, guys? No shout outs. No shout outs. Like you, like you guys aren't shouting anyone out. Like you see, Alley, Alley Streams, Alley Stream, just Alley Stream. Yeah, I'm the only one on there. So yeah. All right. Oh shoot! I'm not even sharing anything, am I? What the hell? No, you are. I'm sharing. sharing. You're sharing. Yeah, you're sharing your Instagram stuff. What? Okay. It's weird when I click out, it goes black. I'm like, what the frick? <laughs> Hopefully, you guys saw his work. If not, shit. Go check him out. Oh, Iron, Iron Pinky. Were you on it's YouTube? Like... Did you see it through YouTube? I saw it through YouTube. Yeah. Oh hell yeah. Okay. Now it's all black. Okay. All right, guys. All right. Let me just have this little little thing I like to do at the very end here. Oh, maybe I'll finish this tomorrow. Yeah, we'll, we'll just chill chill here. You guys, thank you for joining us. Yeah, thanks. We'll uh, we'll be back tomorrow with another uh, episode of. Uh, I'll drink like a bunch of energy drinks. The energy drink. Are, you gonna have some coffee just, tonight? Just drink and stream. Well, let's let's, have let's have. You're gonna drink coffee and stream. Wait, do you work tomorrow? No, I don't work tomorrow. No. Uh, Let's have a drunk stream. Let's have a drunk stream. I haven't had a drunk stream. I don't think I've ever had a drunk stream. I invite my 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 followers to <laughs> a new, new can, crowd. That might be kind of fun. Let's do it. All right, you guys, take care. Bada ba boom. Pieces. Give them that piece. Give them your best. Give them your best. Bada ba booms. 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 Bada ba booms.